too. That's a pretty, pretty golden fish. Wow. Oh look, eagle. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's my eagle call. <laughs> Howdy friends. Well, those of you who have been watching these videos <laughs> might recognize this spot. This creek's been real good to me this year. Tonight I have two hours. I've been kind of fishing this by default. My kids go to soccer way, way further away than from where we live than we'd like. Then I drive another 15 minutes to fish this little creek. Tonight I have two full hours till dark. It's a little higher. Not by much, but a little. We had some rain last week. But it's clear. Oh, there's a nice blue heron flying over there. I've got two hours and my strategy, and hey, I wanna say thanks too for everybody who's been uh, watching these and encouraging me. It, it's, it's a lot of fun making these and some of you have found a new, rekindled your love for fishing. That's just awesome to hear. It makes me feel like, I don't know, it just adds a little bit of depth and meaning to what I'm doing, which already feels, you know, significant and meaningful. That's a whole lot of fun. And uh, I want to attribute this uh, video to my friend Daniel, who parted from this life uh, earlier this week. He loved fishing, and I wish I'd got to fish them a little more, but uh, rest in peace, my friend. This one's for you. Maybe the next one too. Here's the strategy tonight. We're actually going to fish downstream instead of upstream. And I'm going to... I got the Whopper Plopper, of course. Surprise, surprise. It's just been so good for me, good to me. The Whopper Plopper 85. On my way back upstream, if we don't do well, I'm just, I've got this little back up here. It's just a 64th ounce hair jig under a bobber. I'm going to try it with some crappie nibbles, and you never know, it could catch any manner of fish, but uh, if we catch anything over 10 or 12 inches, it's going to feel like a giant on that setup, so here we go. I'm going to try to get a little further downstream than I've, than I've been able to get at this place before. Roll up the sleeves and uh, away we go. I got my Hodgman wading boots on. If there's still a company called Hodgman, why don't you send me a pair of free boots? Because I've used your boots for 20 years now. <laughs> and they're falling apart. But man, a good pair of wading boots makes all the difference. Oh, there was one. Just missed my first strike. Well, that's a good sign. That's a great sign. Let's see if there's anything in shallow here. Oh, dang. Thought I had one, but I'm snagged. Oh, oh, gee. Had a bump. Finally. Oh, folks, this feels like a hard-earned trophy. <laughs> I think there's one following him, too. Hard-earned trophy smallmouth of the night. Nice gold little bronze back, fella. Oh, thanks for... Thanks for making my night there, bud. Oh. Okay. That's a pretty, pretty golden fish. Wow. Oh, look. Eagle. Oh, yeah. <coughs> <laughs> That's my eagle call. <laughs> oh, sweet. That was cool. Bald eagle. Not much of an eagle call, but you know, you do what you can do. You do the best you can. 
Oh, I had another fish too. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Oh yeah. That's the same as last one maybe. Oh, come on. Come on, dude. Oh, I had him in hand. Oh, come on. Oh, a little better. A little better. Hey, maybe the eagle brought us some luck. See, you never know. You catch a fish, you see an eagle. You catch another fish. What do you say about that? Thanks, dude. Thank you. Later. Later days. Come see me again. <laughs> Come see me again one time. Man. Well, are we going to catch some fish all of a sudden or what? Look at that. Number three. All of a sudden. I just had to switch baits. Same as last one. Okay, we're calling that three. Same spot, what's going on? Dare we get number four? Look at that. Oh, this one might be a bigger fish actually. Might be a bigger fish. Hit it pretty good. stacked up in here. Wow. Fish number four. Look at that. On that nice little, I guess it's a little shad. Oh, that goes look pretty good too. Fish number four. Oh man, I'm gonna keep going. If they're here, they gotta be other. Oh well, don't miss your life away. Don't wish your life away. There we go. <laughs> How was that for a, a bold jump? Fish number five. Small. Small, small mouth, as it were. Little guy, I think, yeah. Little guy. All right, oh, rock bass. Huh, first rock bass here in a while. Okay. Okay, that's all right, that's all right. Do we have enough light for one more fish yet under the bridge, I hope? Because that's where I think the best chance is of a, of a big boy. Oh, there we go. Oh, right by, right by my feet. Right by my feet. Oh, he got off. Oh, shoot. Ah. Oh, that would have been what? Seven or eight? Ay, ay, ay. He was right there. You probably couldn't see that one. That was another nicer one. They're on the prowl. They're on the prowl. Oh, there we go. Hey. Here we go. Oh, a nice jump. Nice jumper. Nice jumper in the current. 
There you go. Oh yeah. You can get them out of the current here, up on the sand. Nice. Another one. Wow. This lure is on fire. Oh yeah. Well, it definitely lost too bigger than that one. But uh, that's a lot of fish here in a short little amount of time. Well, that's where there's a nice fishing lure for somebody who's willing to go get it. <laughs> oh. oh, fudge nuggets. <laughs> <laughs> 